what's up buddy how you doing and today we're going to talk about MGTOW stuff let's talk about number one the negative reputations that MGTOW have well there are some idiots who say that we're incels or gays that we are MGTOW because we can't get laid these type of idiots what they don't know is that they fail because we just don't take we don't acknowledge their shaming tactics and also let's talk about topic number two female chameleons now female chameleons will never be a mix up for the same reason as as a frog will never be a dinosaur because they're two completely different things females are not males so they cannot join join makeup Speaking of who can join MGTOW, topic number three. Speaking of who can join MGTOW, here's topic number three. Idiots who think there is an age criteria in MGTOW. No, there's not. It doesn't say men over 18 join MGTOW. It just says men, men over 18 go their own way. It says men go their own way, which means men of all men of all age criteria can join MGTOW from zero to the end of their lives topic number five feminism now I'm going to address feminism as this feminism used to be no used is a radical group that radical hateful group that wants to exterminate men see the familiar thing feminism acts like the Gestapo and they want to exterminate men also topic number five hashtag me too now there are some idiots who think hashtag me too is good it's not good it's a witch hunt against men. A stupid witch hunt indeed. That will fail. Also, the actions of the Me Too witch hunters are very similar to the actions of the WAP and SS. Very similar. Now, topic number four. Future of MGTOW. MGTOW is going to have a really good future in 2019. Because more and more will join us. Oh, I got a lot. Now, topic number six. The anti MGTOWs. Similarly to MGTOW Shamers, but they attack MGTOW ruthlessly. But they'll fail the same way as the MGTOW Shamers because they just want to attack MGTOW and they'll fail. Now, topic number seven. I wanted to tell you that we'll do more and more interviews with me, or MGTOW, and... And this, these live streams. Me, the live streams, interviews with Portuguese Victor Redfield Wisdom, and a lot more if you recommend to me. I also did a really good celebration of. I celebrated my Valent. my. my MGTOW Day. my MGTOW International Day, not the Schittenstein. Kuckenstein's Day. I meant International MGTOW Day. I celebrated it by eating candies and then shooting a gun, which is what most males do. They eat whatever they want and then shoot candies. Speaking of them, Portuguese MGTOW will like to eat porridge. I'm not. Fuck this. There's only international. Topic number eight. 
quick number eight. How MGTOW started? Well, MGTOW started in 2001 when the MGTOW oh. commandments were put on the internet for everyone to see. Everyone was able to see the commandments. Like it in a way that they're going to want their traditional equipment, but they don't like it because it's no marriage. PUAs. PUAs are the biggest flop in the dog because they do the activities that can lead them to a me too. We have taken the enemy. <laughs> I cannot grab the answer. No problem, I do this all the time. I could do this for money. I know, but I could. Spy. They sure do have fame. Ha ha ha, I'm going to be a spy. <laughs> Let's wait for some unfortunate blue. Team prick, prick, let's come over here. Bye-bye.